Okay guys, so welcome to our new video. So we start with problem number one. So last video natin. So diniskas natin yung first three rules ng algebraic substitution. So apply natin ngayon yung first three. Okay, so we start with problem number one. So the problem is the integral of dx over the square root of x plus the fourth root of x raised to the third power. So papansin yung so, ano yung function natin? So, x lang. So, variable x or, yeah, variable x. So, in this case, so, papatok yan sa algebraic substitution rule number 1, which is power of x mo is, yun lagi na erase dun sa irrational exponent. So, first thing dito guys, ang gagawin natin, ang goal natin dito, palitan natin lahat ng ito, dx mo, gagawin mong dz, yung x gagawin mong z. Then, tsaka natin siya i-integrate. Then, last, ibabalik natin yung power of x. O yung x variable natin. Okay. So, first, identify natin yung mga exponent. Diba? So, ano yung mga irrational exponent? So, una, yung square root of x. So, pwede mo siyang gawing x to the 1 half. Diba? Ayan. So, ilakay natin. So, 1 half. Ayan. Ayan, 1 half. Then, eto, yung second power no or sorry say, yung irrational exponent naman ng another variable x mo ano siya so 3 over 4 so in this case ang gagawin natin identify natin yung n which is ano yung n natin if you remember yan yung lcd or least common denominator no irrational exponent natin so in this case ano yung lcd niyan 1 half and 3 fourth or sa baba yung denominator lang titignan nyo 2 and 4, yun na, yung LCD ng 2 and 4. So, that is 4. So, yun na, we already identify our N. So, gawin natin, so, balik tayo dun sa original formula. So, anong gagamitin formula natin? Yung substitution, yung Z is equal to the nth root of X. So, in this case, ano yung N natin? 4. So, Z, so, papalitan nyo, 4th root of X. And, if you take the 4th of both our Nirace nyo sa 4th power in both sides. So, z to the 4th is equals to x. So, guys, ito na yung magiging substitution natin. So, ang gagawin natin, so, yung x na to, papalitan natin ngayon ng z to the 4th. Then, yung x na to, or yan yun, ito rin naman yun. So, yung x dito, papalitan natin ng z to the 4th. And yung x dito, ng z to the 4th. Eh, sir, how do we get the dx? di-differentiate ngayon natin to What is the di differentiation of z to the 4th? So, power formula. So, 4 z cube dz is equals to dx. So, yun yung maging substitution natin sa dx. So, dz na. Or dz na. Or derivative of the z function. Or substitution. So, clear now guys? So, yun. So, ipalit na natin ngayon. So, integral of. So, yung dx, papalitan mo ng 4 z cube dz over yung x, papalitan mo ng z to the fourth. So, square root ng z to the fourth plus fourth root nung yung x cube. Yung x dun, papalitan mo ngayon ng z to the fourth. So, lagay mo sa loob yung z to the fourth cube. So, clear? So, what will be our uh, so, sorting value. So, magiging 4 z cube dz over what is the square root of z to the 4? So, magiging z squared. And then, plus what is the z or pag multiply niya, z to the 12. So, 12 divided by 4 so, yung may divide yan eh. So, magiging 3. So, z cube na siya. So, clear guys. So, basic algebra na yan. So, dapat alam nyo na yan. So, sa part. So, baka simple na sa inyo pag simplify nyan. Okay? Hindi na dapat problem yan. Okay, clear now. So, kung papansin nyo, may common, di ba? So, pwede, ka mag, pwede mong i-factor out yung constant na 4. Then, by the way guys, so, okay na to. So, if you're asking, sir, okay na po ba yan? Okay na yan. Since, yung value, yung function of x mo dito, napalitan mo na ngayon ng substitution z or yung function z. So, okay na yan. So, proceed na tayo sa integration. So, before that, so, kung may uh, cancel out tayo, so, dito, common yung 
z squared. So, factor out natin yung z squared sa numerator. So, z na lang may e1. Then, sa denominator din, same. So, z squared. So, may e1 is 1 plus z na lang. So, cancel out yung z squared. So, may, uh, ang nangyari is 4 integral of z over dz over 1 plus z. How do we simplify this now, guys? So, hindi naman pwedeng u yan. So, substitution, let u, ba? So, kailangan i-divide natin to. So, we divide z by 1 over z. So, it becomes, so, z divided by 1 plus z, or z plus 1. Uh, z plus 1. Z plus 1. So, Z divided by Z, that's 1. Then, multiply nyo. So, 1 times A, or Z. 1 times 1 plus 1. Then, inverse. Inverse sign. So, negative, negative. So, 0, negative 1. So, it means may remainder 1 ka. So, the division now becomes 4. Integral of. So, may iwan sa loob na yan. So, 1 minus then, ito, divided by z plus 1 or 1 over z dz. Then, kung kapansin nyo, pwede natin i-distribute nyo yung uh, integral sign, tsaka yung constant for then dz. So, pwede at, uh, after distributing, so, ito na. So, 4 so, yun, 4 integral of dz minus 4 integral of dz over z plus 1. And what is the integral of dz? z, diba? So, 4z na lang yan. Minus 4 times, what is dz over z plus 1? So, let u, diba? u yan, diba? ln yan. So, u is equals to z plus 1. So, du is dz. So, du over u yan. So, ln of c plus 1 plus c. Sir, tapos na po ba? Hindi pa. So, we need to substitute back yung z natin. So, ano yung z natin original? Ito. Diba ito? z is equal to the fourth root of x. Diba balik natin? So, the final answer is 4 times the fourth root of x. Since kailangan function of x yung final answer. So, lakayin natin. So, okay. Nakayin natin. 4 times the 4th root of x minus 4. Natural logarithm of, ano yung z natin? 4th root of x plus 1 plus c. And this will be our final answer. So, yeah. so 4, then 4th root of x. So, ibabalik natin nga. Minus 4. Natural logarithm of 4. The 4th root of x. So, root yan guys sa 4th root. Hindi yung ano ba? 4th root, not constant 4. Alright. So, so 4th root of x plus 1 plus c. So, dito galing yan, guys. Ayan, yan to. The 4th root of x. So, clear? So, yun. So, ganyan yung uh, flow na solution pag yung variable x mo in lang yun nandun sa integral or sa integral natin. So, ganyan yung flow. Okay guys, so yun lang. So, dapat as early as na or at this point, so kabisado ang kabisado nyo yun yung mga basic integration nyo guys. O kahit sa differentiation, so huwag nyo kakalimutan. Okay, so gamit na gamit kasi dito yan. Okay, so on our next video, we'll proceed with problem number 2.